Leadership is about the actions and the decisions you make at your defining moments. The problem is irrelevant, it's your response that matters. The practice of programming is about to be transformed dramatically. And we won't program computers the way we did in the past. AI is the electricity of our times. And as with electricity, it's not obvious how you should use it. And so our goal at the Academy is to provide some deep insights about AI in general and business AI specifically in the two weeks that the engineers are here. I'm really super excited, <laughs> curious to see what's coming and what's awaiting us. And I was looking around the plane, trying to see if somebody looks like an SAP person, but hey, it turns out you cannot really tell. <laughs> It's like 11 p.m. in our home time zone, so we have to get some good sleep so that we can start like with fresh energy tomorrow, right, for the first session. It was a very conscious decision that we picked the best of the best. And so everything is designed around focusing the learning experience. Generative AI is one of the most misunderstood fields around. When people think a computer should be accurate, a computer should know what it's doing. Computers don't make mistakes, you know, they're all deterministic. But no, they aren't. In some sense, programming is becoming obsolete, but somebody has to figure out how to wrangle the results out of these systems, and that's the role that programmers will have. Our main goal from a technology perspective is to enable people on generative AI, but it's not only about technology, it's also about personal growth. It turns out the data are very clear. Cynics do slightly less well on cognitive tests than non-cynics, and they're much worse at picking out liars from truth tellers. True leaders lead with trust. If you trust people, a lot of things happen very quickly. I feel really amazed. It's a bit overwhelming. This is a unique experience. This is something what you cannot tell. You have to feel it. It's just such a diverse group and we click like this. When I came, I did not expect the program to be like this. So it's not just building technical skills, but it's more building the character. We believe that engineers should have all sorts of dimensions added to them. So in a way, you become not just the best of engineers, but you also do your craft in such a way that it's doing good out there in the world. You are incredibly fortunate. You're smart, you're articulate. You can go and change the lives of people. Make that your mission. Great companies are built because they alleviate pain. You don't start with what you like to do, what you have been doing, what you're good at. You don't start with you, you start with them. And you work backwards from them to solve their pain. My biggest takeaway is that our mission here is to forward humanity. It's not just to build software, it's to make the world a better place. My favorite things about this solution is actually the problem. Sometimes you start with a problem and it seems kind of small, and the more you get into it, the more you realize this is actually a really big problem. Great work. I like this solution. I particularly really interested in the evaluation uh, piece as well from AI and, and data science perspective. We have the creme de la creme of engineering here, right? So I'm not uh, surprised, but this is really mind-blowing and the ideas are very good and they make me very, very excited about the future of SAP, to be honest with you, if we have this kind of catalyst around us. The journey has been incredible. I can honestly say that I'm not the same person I was two weeks ago. And I feel here in the Academy, you learn to play with the strength of people and not play into their weaknesses. Yeah, something that I will take back to my team is to always have the empathy in mind and the other person in mind to really work with them and think from their perspective. We placed a big bet with the Academy that a small group of people can have a big impact. Being the Ripple is a reminder of people who walk through these doors to amplify what they know. The engineers who come here are culture carriers. They are the ones who are going to carry the culture of the company forward. Be the ripple, be the inspiration, be the influence. So that, as a collective, we can take SAP to the next generation, to the future.